Christmas, so we want to put you guys in the Christmas mood. A little song that I wrote for my beautiful wife, Joanna, and these guys did their magic to it, and uh, we want to do it for you. It's our Christmas present to you. Merry Christmas, my love. There was a man who sang his way through life with a smile With his guitar, his music came to life, made you smile And through his songs, he left a path of hope his way and all around everybody loved to hear him play and he sang of joy and of pain and he sang with passion and with Jesse. Uh, and when my mom asked me to uh, make a video on what really means to me, it's, uh, been, it's, it's been a while since I actually uh, made the commitment to do it and actually doing it. Uh, it's been very hard to get the words in my mind and, and what actually I'm going to say uh, because the man has meant so much to me, continues to mean so much to me. Um, some of you know what I do and who I am and without him and his guidance, I wouldn't be where I'm at right now. I wouldn't even be in my mind. So I grew up, was born in Sun Valley, grew up in Lincoln Heights and East LA. And as, many as, you, as much as many as you know, uh, the area and, and the challenges that that encompasses, um, the man showed me that there was a way out and there was, you were, your worth was more than what was being told to you. Um, and he did, his actions every day of him going to the studio, him just making music, him just being him, uh, meant the world to me. Uh, he, he gave me words that I'll never forget. I called the man Silver Fox because that's what he was. He had just luscious hair that wouldn't go away. Uh, he played the guitar like a madman. And I just, I, it's very, very hard for me, for me to do this. Um, 
I, it's, it's, I catch myself listening to his music sometimes and just crying because he's gone. He's gone. And his time on this world has been a blessing to many, uh, and to my family especially. Um, I just remember running around backstage young and everyone just accepting us for who we were. Uh, just a couple of, me and my, my two sisters, just a couple of ghetto kids uh, trying to figure things out. And he, he guided the way, he showed us the light. Um, as I grew older, I started to read about him and, and, and learn from him and people around him and what he actually meant to the community. Uh, I remember walking around East LA with him, or excuse me, Lincoln Heights with him, and people would scream out, hey Rudy, and he would stop every single time and talk to them. They always had a story of, of, of how they made him feel, how, they, how he made them feel better just by talking to them and, and, and understanding their story. And that's why I, now one of my personal uh, goals in life is to come back to the community and give, uh, show the young up and comers that there's a way, there's a different way and you're, you're worth more than you know. So with that, Rudy, I miss you. Uh, my kids miss you, my wife miss you, my mom misses you. Uh, with this guitar back there, uh, I'm gonna, it's hard to look at it. It's hard to do this video. It's hard to go on. The man wasn't my biological father, but he was my dad. I miss you, man. I hope you're looking down on us. I hope you're proud. Thank you.